Hello everybody. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today is Tuesday, December 7th, 2021, and I have a party closeout to share with you. Uh, this came in a very nice large box today earlier and I wasn't looking for it, so that was even more exciting. And I do have some um, some wonderful things and one surprise because this is something I had not seen before at the end of this video. So I'm going to start with these scent circles. Um, when we close out a party, and all a party is, is a shopping link um, over a period of time, and you accumulate product credit, free credit, for the number of dollars spent. So as a consultant, if my customers are shopping in my party, then I get a certain amount of free product, um, depending upon how much the total sales um, amount to. And really, anyone can do this. So if you would like me to set you up a shopping link there are no strings attached to this and if you know you're going to spend a couple of hundred dollars or more over a few months you might as well get some free product credit for it i used to be very suspicious of parties but it really is as good as it seems i have a customer right now ready to close one out and i think that's um, it's been delightful for both of us to see how well it has gone these are scent circles, and I typically pick these up in every party. I like these very much. I like to give these as customer gifts, and I like to use them in drawers and closets. Um, to me, these are not as strong as the car bar for use in the car. These are more for under the pillow, in the dresser drawer, in the closet. So I have three in apple and cinnamon sticks, which is a beautiful, fruity, spicy blend. I have three in cashmere and corduroy which is a very calming, pleasing, amber, um, comforting kind of scent. I've got one in cedar cider because I want to put this in the coat closet <laughs> in the front of the house. I have three in sea salt and avocado, which is a beautiful, uh, refreshing scent. Don't let that avocado note worry you. It doesn't, I don't know that an avocado has a real smell, strong smell. It's a more of a, just a freshness. And we have three in Johnny Appleseed. You know, I wasn't a real big apple fan until I joined Scentsy. Um, I really love our apple scents, and this is just a beautiful, crisp, um, refreshing apple, and I think this will go nicely in dresser drawers. And finally, three in Winterberry Apple Tea. I love this scent. This is a beautiful, oh, it, it's a deep, uh, fruity, spicy blend, but not red hot cinnamon it's a lovely blend with clove nutmeg and um, we have this in every format right now there's the counter clean uh, uh, the facial scrub the scentsy soak for the bathtub um, really we have this in every in what the wax of course and, and um, room spray so that's the first i think i have 13 there of, of scent circles and like I said I, I get these in every party and I tend to use them as the half price items because my goal with a party is to spend as little as possible so I go for lower priced items on my half priced items some people use the opposite approach and take that half price item and go for the higher price things and get them at a great discount so there's multiple ways to to work out the strategy of a party okay next up I'm going to show you this is going to be a gift. I got one of these small mini diffusers. This is for our pods um, system, and it's the pink one. This comes with a USB cord. It can plug right into a computer, and you have a little scent source just right there by your desk. So this is not meant to be room filling, but it will do nicely in a small room. One pod uh, lasts up to 120 hours, and I really love this. I love the pod system. So that's our mini diffuser. It comes in multiple colors. Then, for the first time, I bought a warmer stand, and this is the tin. And as with so many things that I have purchased from Scentsy, such as some of the warmers, this is much heavier than I anticipated. This is really solidly made, very attractive. And the intent here is that your warmer is going to sit on this on a table and absorb any of the heat um, that might come from the warmer. And in addition, you have this recessed section underneath where you can put your cord around and then you don't have cord hanging everywhere also it has two openings so that you could have a piece of the cord sticking out with the um, the turn on and off switch 
So I think that's very clever, and I, I'm quite taken with that. So we have these in multiple styles, and that's the first one I've ever gotten. So I'm going to pause a second because I have three plug-in warmers to show you, and I'm going to move the camera just a tad. So the first of the three wall plug-in warmers, a mini warmer that I have to show you, is the Lavender Love, and this came out at the same time as the Life's a Garden um, collection last spring. So I do have the full-size warmer, which matches this one, and for some reason I never got the mini warmer. So I went ahead and did that with this party, and when you turn it on, it does have a beautiful glow. Let's see if I can get the light a little better in here. And this is a 15 watt bulb warmer and I think it is just lovely with the sprigs of lavender coming up the side. Really that is very pretty lit or unlit. So that is Lavender Love. Our next mini warmer is the Ocean, now what is it again? Ocean Life and mini warmer and look at this guy so this is a ceramic warmer it is much heavier than I thought it is not glossy it has more of a matte finish it, I think it's very elegant looking so we have the sand dollar a crab an octopus a sea star we have some coral a puffer fish a lobster various mollusks a nautilus this is lovely so I am quite pleased with this. Well, let me plug him in. And the, the seahorse is right on the front. And there he is lit. I don't think my camera is capturing as beautiful as it looks in person, but you get the idea. And again, this is a 15 watt bulb warmer. And that is Ocean Life. Before I show you the third warmer, I wanted to share something. When you unpack all of your um, hardware for your mini um, wall plug-in warmers, there's a couple things that are interesting. First of all, the, this socket is oriented with the ground down, but sometimes you'll have one on the side or on the top. So if that's the case, this comes with a button on here and you just push that and you can reorient your plug according to how your wall is set up because you will have the, that orientation quite different in different locations sometimes, especially in an older home. And the other thing is, when you unpack everything, you'll find a little tiny baggie with, with a gasket in it. And at first I just did not know what to do with that. But this is meant to slip over just the base of the plug and what that does then when you this is the gingerbread man warmer when you insert the the plug part into the the base then it makes it tighter and that way this top doesn't want to rock and roll because if you don't do that you may find that your your warmer will wiggle and especially when you have hot wax in there, you don't want that. So I learned that the hard way. It's like, oh, do we really need that gasket? In fact, you do. Okay, so this guy, look at him. So we have the gingerbread man warmer, and he is chilling, chilling in the coffee mug. Just adorable. So I love the colors. All of these are hand painted. And then when you put the light on, it has this effect and you get some light play on the wall behind. He is adorable. He's kicked back. That's the, that's the approach we should all take to the holidays. Look how relaxed he is. Again, 15 watt bulb. Um, I always recommend getting light bulbs. Patricia Gates taught me that and she is so right. Always order a, an extra set of light bulbs when you're ordering a warmer because eventually you're going to need to change it out. I love that we have multicolored light bulbs, but for these, probably the clear is just fine because you don't have the opacity on this one that's going to make much of a light effect. Now on the other ones you might, like Lavender Love, the purple one might be beautiful in that. Also the Ocean Life, maybe a blue light bulb in that one. 
So this one is Gingerbread Man. And there he is. So also from this party, I um, found two full-size warmers that I love. And the first is the Vino warmer. And this one will be a gift to my neighbor. I walk with two different uh, ladies in the neighborhood. And the one who lives a little bit further east of me, um, she and her husband are wine enthusiasts. And they go to the local vineyard, which has um, live music. It is a lot of fun up there. So I thought this would be a great present for her. So this is the Vino warmer. And the way this one works, this is metal. And it, it looks like um, it looks like vines wrapped around a, a wine bottle. It has that effect. And inside you have the glass dish, which has the number four in it, saying two schools of thought there. No more than four, or four is best performance, four cubes. Okay. And then we have the glass sleeve that fits down inside. And this is pretty pretty sturdy. It's substantial. And it's a 25, excuse me, it is a 40 watt Edison bulb. So it's going to be warmer than many of our, our uh, warmers. It should be a great little thrower. So my friend Michelle Fia bought this um, warmer a while ago and she was pleased with it and I really trust her judgment so that's why I went ahead with it and she said it is a good thrower. And a word to the caution when you unpackage these Scentsy packages extremely well and this had a styrofoam ring down in the bottom that I didn't notice right away always check for uh, cardboard or styrofoam pieces that have helped stabilize it during um, travel but it, you wouldn't want to have in there when it was hot. Okay, so I am going to turn this fellow on. And that's over here. And there you go. Oh, that is lovely. Isn't that beautiful? It just looks like the dried vines around the wine bottle. That's classy. I like that very much. So that is the Vino Warmer. Again, a 40-watt Edison bulb. So it's going to be quite warm and is a good thrower a good thrower. And I have one more to show you. So finally, this is the surprise I have to show you because this is the first time I'm seeing this. This is one of our new releases. It is called the Candy Christmas Warmer and it is a gingerbread house. And as always, the pictures in the catalog and on the website just don't really do it justice. So this is a metal warmer, and let me show you a little bit closer up. It does have some glitter, all the gingerbreading, all the windows are open. This is all hand painted, different colored details, all these different colored details along the edge, and it's metal. So it's while it's lightweight, it is not as lightweight as the Haunted Mansion metal warmer was. And then the little house itself, we have the relatively large dish. This still has a number four in it, and it is a glass dish. And then we have the little gingerbread guys on the front, little gal and fellow on the front, and a beautiful wreath. Again, all hand painted. All the windows are open, have bushes on both sides, and another window in the back. So there's plenty of space for the scent to come out. This is a 25 watt bulb warmer, as you can see. And I, let me reassemble this. I think that is beautiful. So this is, this is heavy compared to the Haunted Mansion, which was very lightweight. Um, I don't think that it's neither here nor there, except I think it might be a bit more stable on the table. So let us go ahead and light this beautiful and you look at that. So you, again, you do get some light play on the walls behind because the windows are all open and the light will come out. And the scent is going to have no problem coming out. Above the dish, we have the windows front and back. And then we have windows on the sides as well. And there's a bit of room between the dish 
in the front and in the back, so the scent is going to have plenty of ways to come out. So I'm quite pleased with that. I think it's lovely, and it's a nice addition to my holiday warmers. I don't have another gingerbread house. So I'm going to put everything together and then close this out. So Clementine is here to help me close out this video. So just in summary, we have two full-size warmers, the Vino warmer and the Candy Christmas warmer. We have the three plug-in mini warmers, which is Ocean Life, Gingerbread Man, and Lavender Love. We have the, <laughs> we have the cat, which did not come with the party. Thank you, Clem. We have 13 scent circles. We have the stand and we have a mini pod diffuser. So um, I'm really pleased with this and very grateful to Sensi that we're allowed to do parties because it is a wonderful way to um, get more product that then I can review for all of you, that I can use as gifts and that I can enjoy for our, our um, delight here in the house. So thank you so much for watching and uh, let's all try and be like this gingerbread man this Christmas and just take it easy. Remember to be kind to one another. Hug your families. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.